game underway. Takes it inside his own 20. Chance for great field position here. He just Whoa, about him. popped that one for a long one, but as it is, he gives his team a lot of momentum with a solid return. Quarterback empties his backfield. He wastes no time and comes out throwing. He's got his man. Oh, what a move! They ripped off a big one and they get it down to the 27. Go, go. Illinois right back to the line. That receiver found the open space in the zone coverage. And as a defense, honestly, you just throw your hands up on that because they covered it pretty well. It was just a good play call. Really nice execution. I love it. I love it. First down. Let's be aggressive. Let's throw the football. But how about the quarterback? He does a great <laughs> job in the pocket, buying time. Up, oh, nobody opens, scrambles around, and more importantly, ends the run, gets the first down, and doesn't get whacked. Beautiful. From the 17-yard line, threatening to score on first and ten. They'll ride the running back and leave it with him. And he's able to shed one tackle and gets a pretty good pickup. And as an offensive coordinator, you don't need the perfect play with this guy as your running back. He's going to make the play perfect for you because he makes everybody miss. Spin moves, hurdles, stiff arms, speed, whatever it takes to move the sticks and score touchdowns. Birch is way ahead for about three. It's down at the eighth. High quarters deep in the red zone, but they can pick up a first down without scoring. Third down. They get him on the ground, but not before he gets enough for the first down. This offense has really gotten to a nice rhythm here on their opening drive of the game. Running the ball, getting it down now into a goal-to-go situation. And he takes it in for the score. Touchdown, Illinois! The offense goes to see him, so really no surprise on the opening drive. They keep feeding him the football. He shows you all of his ability on that TV. And he's got the extra point, and it's 7-0 to start this one. So that scoring drive took only six plays and closed the deal with a three-yard touchdown run. The kickoff team takes the field to boot this one away. Here he comes from inside his own five. And he did a good job bobbing and weaving and finding a little bit of running room on that return. down here comes this offense now the quarterback changing the original play call he wants to start this drive with a pass working on the right and they'll finally bring him down after he rips off a huge play Alabama may always be built on the run but these days they elevate with a high flying pass game and great coaches evolve. And we've seen the evolution of this Alabama offense over the last several years. And it's not just run. It's not just eat clock. It is be aggressive, attack, make big plays down the field. And a nice, solid pickup there before the defense wrestles him to the ground. After the productive first down play, it's second and six. Looking downfield, it's Howard. Unloads it left. It's caught downfield. And it is a chunk play, a huge gain on that one before the defense brings it to an end. The Tide with the first and ten. He's looking to throw it. He caught it! Wow, wow. the quarterback knew he had to get that one to his receiver quickly on the end route. Did you see the velocity on that throw? Operating in the red zone here on second down. From the gun, they'll try to impose their running game. He stopped just short of the goal line, but they'll have it first and goal from the one. Uh, 
They'll try to open the quarter by cashing in on this big opportunity deep in the red zone. He's looking to pass. Flips it out to the back. Let's go, let's go. And he's into the end zone. Touchdown, Alabama! Now they'll line up for what they hope is automatic. Splits those uprights right in half. So that scoring drive took only six plays. He'll start the return inside his five. Really disciplined job by the coverage unit to get down there and make the stop at the 19. Here comes the Illini offense back onto the field. Really good balance on that last drive. They mixed it up all over the place, Jesse. Yeah, and how nice, too, to have the defense on. Just slithered through the tackle, and he's got room to run. Finally run out of bounds, but he has his offense rolling with a first down. That is a time-honored way to slow down the rush, hit him with the screen, and a chunk play. Yeah, such a great job because you're flying up the field to get to the quarterback because everything looks like pass down the field. Let those guys get up the field, throw it right behind him. He does a little bit of the rest, making some moves, getting upfield, making the big play. And he was able to get away from one tackle, but plenty of help was on the way. Decent pickup on that play. You want to talk about making it easy for an offensive coordinator. You pick up a bunch of yards on first down, make that second down really, really manageable. That's a great job by the offense. Looking to the big tight end. And that one falls incomplete, trying to get a chunk play on that one. I think when you go through these progressions as a quarterback, you want to find the right guy to throw to, obviously. I just, I didn't think he was the right guy. I didn't think he was really that open. And listen, he sailed and he overthrew. But I might have surveyed the middle of the field a little bit better. Can't make the connection on third down thanks to that tough, hard-nosed pass defense, and now it's fourth down. Third and short like that on your own side of the field, you're just looking for a quick hitter. You're trying to get the ball out of your hand quickly, but the timing completely off there for the offense, and the ball falls incomplete. Got all they needed for the first down, and then he gets down on the slide. Yeah, I think you're just seeing the experience this guy has, right? He's so poised that initially he's flushed out of the pocket, nothing's open, and he doesn't panic. He's not throwing it away. He's not sliding early. He just knows where the defense isn't. Mm. He's able to attack that space with his speed and get a positive play. Illinois moving it quickly down the field. To the air. It's Howard. Quarterback extends the play. He's run out of bounds, but not before. Turning in a big pickup and moving the sticks for a first down. Man, that's so frustrating. And it happens so fast. He just pulls it down. It looks like pass. He pulls it down, and he's gone. Just like that, chewing up yards. So much speed, so hard to stop. From the gun, running back gets to give. Man, that D tackle is a freak athlete. Did you see him come out of his stance and beat the offensive lineman? Getting to the running back, cat-like quickness. They've been running it, but now the pass. Coming after it. On the run, and he'll slide to avoid the hit and nifty pick up there. Well, great job there by the defense because they weren't able to get him sacked right away, but you saw the coverage in the back end. Nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football. Didn't get the sack, obviously. You don't get the negative play, but you also don't give up a big one. You're feeling pretty good about where you are right now in this game. Caught behind the line. It's Johnson. He's right there to stop him, but the quick throw and catch enough to give them the first down. Shotgun fundamentals are so key. He was like a shortstop. Caught the shotgun snap and right away rifled it out of his hands like he was turning too. That was beautiful. They'll give it to the back. And a good, solid pick up there before the defense knocks him down. 
Listen, you, you got to be able to know what play to call and what hole to go through. Like the line blocks for a certain hole. Good job getting through the hole, getting on this block, getting a nice positive gain, making your situation really good on the next down. Tackled, but he has a first down. Man, that was a good run, but it was almost even better. Great job by the offense. Keep the running game going. You get big chunks like this. Not only was that a big chunk, it also looked like oh, it could have gone for more. Okay, Illinois it's looking to pay things off it's on first and goal. Looking to throw it's Howard. They've got the screen set up. Touchdown, Illini! That is the ultimate grab and go for the score. And I just love the execution by this offense. Late in the half, man, you want to take the lead. You want to get that momentum on your side, and they do it. They finish it with the passing game. And tell you what, keep that passing game up. Keep this lead, keep the momentum, and keep putting up numbers. So they got the touchdown now, going to put it in the hands of their defense to finish off this half. Ball bouncing all over the place and corralled around the 30. And the return man has no place to run, no place to hide, and a place to be tackled. Here comes that Alabama offense. There's enough time left in the half here, David, to make something happen. Dang right. I, I want to be aggressive. I I'm not backed up in my own end. I, I can stay aggressive here. Try to get a field goal, Palmer. Try to get in range to get some kind of points before half. Yeah, two biggest things are you got to protect the... Grabs it at the 25 in stride. And he slipped through the crowd and Let's he'll go. house it. Touchdown, Crimson Tide. PAT no. unit on the field. Hit that one with some aggression for the point after. That's the kind of drive everybody loves. So see quarterback one snap, put it in the end zone. So they got the touchdown, and as they kick off, really important for the defense to shut them down here. And he takes this from inside the five. Able to find enough room to get it out across the 25. He's brought down at the 26. down here for the offense. Back to throw, it's Howard. Feeling some heat. And he got smacked just as he released the pass. It's incomplete. Well, this quarterback's already taken a couple shots from the pocket. There's another one right there that affected his accuracy on that throw. On second down, they'll take to the air into traffic it's picked off would have loved to have gotten a big return out of that one but they'll take it first down at the 40. qbs have to understand when i'm throwing against zones i gotta manipulate guys with my eyes i might have to look one direction to create an opening to throw that ball or zip that ball in i gotta use touch it's really hard when all eyes are on me and you could tell the quarterback was not ready and did not unleashes one deep Zone. Touchdown, Bama! That is exactly what most offenses will do. Big momentum play. My defense creates a turnover. I'm being aggressive. I'm going for the big score, the big play down the field. They get rewarded. They get the big passing touchdown. And the extra point splits the uprights. You get that touchdown right before the half, build the momentum, and the last thing you need to do is mess it up by allowing a big kickoff return. From inside the 20, chance for great field position. And you make the stop, and that is the end of the first half. That's the end of the first half. Yeah. Go ahead and roll the dice to start this second half. They're lined up for an onside kick. They're on it. They recover the onside kick, and they get it right back. The Illinois offense returns to the field. They start this third quarter, one possession game, and hoping to get an early drive going. This offense is ready, and they're ready to take the field here and see if they can get... And he's running in the open. They get him down, but this offense is set up first and goal from the nine. Man, 
this offense is so dangerous, Reese. They've got dudes all over the field that can make plays. There's a big gainer in the pass game. You get a chunk of yards like that, now the defense is really on its heels. They'll keep it on the ground for first and goal. They get him on the ground at the three-yard line, but this defense is taking some punches. Illinois lining up quickly. On second and goal, he gets another chance. He pushes it forward all the way to the two-yard line. After giving up that big play, this defense has been a rock. Third and goal coming. And he's a real nowhere man tackled in this no-gain land. This defense has stood tall on three straight plays. Got to wonder if this offense is willing to stay aggressive and go for it. Yeah, in offense nowadays, you should stay aggressive, right? Play the numbers game. Even if you do get stuff. He snares it in the end zone. Touchdown, fighting Illini. Great job by the wide receiver. The windows are so small in this area of the field. You saw him fight through the defender to make that catch on the TD. And the extra point was good. No incident there, and we are tied up in the third. A very efficient five-play scoring drive. And it was finished off with a two-yard touchdown toss. All tied up and just about set to kick it away. Signals for a fair catch around the five-yard line and makes it. Tied offense rolls onto the field. Jesse looking to take it down the field for back-to-back -back touchdowns. I think it's really important for them moving forward, too, to have a lot of bounce, right? You want to be able to keep this defense guessing, Paul. Yeah, and you got me searching for answers after that last drive. You stack another drive on top of this, their defense's heads are going to be spinning all over the place. I, I Looked like the offense had a chance for a big play there, but the running back just could not reel that ball in. This has been a tight one, third quarter, all tied up. It's now second and ten. Wide out in motion. Quarterback changing the plays at the line. He'll try it again on second and ten. And he makes the grab and gets the foot down. Ooh. What a job for a huge game there. This guy is special, and Alabama's had a lot of them. Devontae Smith, Jalen Waddle, Jerry Judy, who could make a huge play at the drop of a hat. Yeah, big plays down the field, you get it to him, you know it could be a, a home run anytime he touches it. When you start mentioning those names, it just shows you the explosive nature. Everybody you mentioned, you know they can run right by you and hit those home runs, and so far, he's making some big plays in this ballgame. Got a good one going here. All tied up in the third. It's second and ten. Give to the back. Able to pick his way forward for a decent game before the defense gets him down. You know, with defense, it's this pick or poison game, right? Like, I got to play a little bit soft and make them run the football. But when I do that, I give the running back space. And right there, you can tell he takes advantage of it. On the run. It's Howard. Fires to the big fella. And he goes down after making the grab. Picks up a few, but still short of the first down. It's a really nice job in coverage defensively there because that tight end, he wasn't really even open. Quarterback just still tried to put it on him and, and give him an opportunity. But great tackle, short of the stick, setting up for him. They'll try it on the ground. And his molars are probably Take rattling that after that big hit, but he did get the first down. In the fourth and inches, man, I'm going for it no matter where I'm at in the field. If I'm in scoring range, if I'm in the red zone, if I'm on the one, I'm going for it. I have to be able to get inches in these situations. Nice job by the offense. It's complete on the right side. And he's down after making the catch, but did not reach the line to gain. Here comes the offense on second down. Quarterback making adjustments with his receivers. Fires to the middle. Got his man downfield. Defense is there to make the stop, but he's got the first down, and they'll have it first and goal with the six. And I love when you understand when I'm supposed to put some RPMs on that football. You can tell he's throwing over the middle of the field. He knows he's got defenders there. I got to throw this thing in there quick, fast, in a hurry. Nice job by the quarterback. They bring him down, and he's going to lose the yard on that one.
They love to start this quarter off with a touchdown right here. Uh, let's see what you do here. To the air, it's Howard. <sighs> Makes the catch. Touchdown time. They move on top here in the fourth. Have a day, young fella. I foresee some social media posts in his future. Not one, not two, but three receiving touchdowns on the day. What a ball. Game. The extra point is good, and now in the fourth, they're up by a touchdown and an extra point. The kickoff team out there getting set. Number 97 sets a kick this one away. On the move from inside is five. Able to find enough room to get it out across the 25. He's brought down at the 26. Here comes the Illini offense back onto the field. Now they need to put something together to answer that last score. There's a lot of pressure, too, on this offense to have to execute it a high. And there was no way to go for this quarterback, and down he goes. Illinois right back to the line. On second down, just keeps firing. The short hands, it's Booker. That one can really put this drive into high gear as they have a first down at the 37. Her route seems simple, but when you time it like that so it's right on him, man, that's a tough play to stop. And give the receiver a lot of credit, too, because he knew where the sticks were. He got his depth on the route, and then he came back to the football. All young receivers can learn from this guy right here. Come back to the ball and help your quarterback. Gotta love the versatility of the big fella. You can put him in the box and let him block big defensive linemen, or you put him in the slot and you throw him the football and have success. We've reached a two-minute warning, and the defense needs to come up with a stop to close this thing out. In search of that tying touchdown. They've moved the chains a couple of times. It's first and ten again. To throw, it's Howard. What a job to lay out and make the catch. Now they've got to hustle to the line and get set. Leaves it with the back. Fakes his man out. And he got enough for the first down, but somebody put the hip stick upside his head. I love when players understand situations, and they understand where the first down marker is, and they understand where I got to get to. A lot of people you'll see run north-south and try to bounce out wide and make big plays. Sometimes it's not about making big plays. Sometimes it's about getting that first down to make sure I get an extra set of downs instead of trying to make those big touchdown runs. Might as well give it to him again. A solid pickup there before the defense is able to make the stop. Going to work in the red zone, they can't pick up the first down without getting it into the end zone. Wants to throw on second down. But a little time, lets it go. Makes his connection. They'll mark him down at the two. The excellent execution on that throw and catch. QBs, when you see zone covers, man, can you manipulate defense when you have a good pocket and you've got time to throw. He had a little bit of time to throw. You can move guys with your eyes. That drag comes wide open. Good throw, good catch, first down. And guys, if they can make their way into the end zone, we'll have a tie game in the fourth, and the stage will be set for a great finish. On the ground. And you can forget running in the middle against this defense. Timeout called here by the defense. It's the first one they've used this half. Great team defense on that run play. Everybody doing their job. People winning their one-on-ones. D linemen staying in their gaps. Linebackers and DBs filling. You just can't do it better. Hey. 
Can the defense stop them again on second and goal? Tries again to get it in. And he is stopped, not getting close to the end zone. Line of scrimmage still at the three. Defense going to use a timeout. Can't afford to have any confusion on the call here. If they can get it in here, we could have a thrilling end to this game. It is third and goal. I'll try to power it in. Strong, firm tackle. Timeout called by the defense. 29 seconds to go. Man, it has been a long drive offensively. I just feel like you've got to pay this off and be aggressive. You're down close. Punch it in for a touchdown here, Pollock. Yeah, and inside the three-yard line, I think I might try to finish this off with a touchdown. I ate up a ton of clock, mm -hmm. wore these guys out. Now they'd have to go the length of the field if I missed. Trailing and getting deep in the game. They'll go for it here on fourth and goal. Dropping back, it's Howard. Fires into the end zone. Picked off. Pass the 50. He's inside the 40. Pass the 20. Touchdown, Alabama! And this defense coming up with points of their own. What an interception to turn. And man, the offense has the lead, game. has the football. All you got to do is run the clock out, maybe be conservative, run the football. They chose to throw, and the defense made.